Hello Gothic friends, Razmin is my name, welcome back to the world's Let's Play of the World, Gothic 2 Livia Edition Hardcore. In today's episode we are going to continue exploring the caves of Corinis and clear some monsters out of the way. So in order to keep advancing we will have to kill some more stuff here. Oh, oh. why is this skeleton also hit? Like hurt. The other one was also a bit hurt, no clue why. Are there more skeletons? I believe that was it, right? Only two skeletons are in this cave. We have to sell our stuff that we have extra... I don't know what's there. We shall see if there is another skeleton. Oh, maybe we should just use the sword. The master sword. But we are digging, we are battling our, uh, our ass away. Yeah, another skeleton could be here. If I'm not mistaken. A chest. I can't believe that we actually have to use the, this armor now. Instead of the dragon hunter. The dragon hunter armor is only good for the dragons apparently. I believe that's it with the skeletons, right? Yeah, we are good at digging. I'm on shards. What? Uh, yeah, the shards, I mean. We don't have to wonder what's with the shards. Probably they are used for... Uh, to hander. Okay. The shards are probably used for some armor crafting and stuff. Nothing else. This was quite poor. But there is another way into the mine. Yeah, this way. Nothing here. Oh, this is out, okay. This is the other way to go into the mine. Plant rat. Also, to whom did this cave belong also? That would be a good question and a good answer. But I don't think there is anything that tells us exactly to whom does it belong. The chest looks quite nice. Ah, nothing. Like, absolutely nothing here worth for the danger that it had. A minecrawler warrior, two rats, and two skeletons. Except the two-hander weapon, maybe. That would be quite useful. I don't know. Well, we are done with it. At least we can keep exploring now. There is the warrior and the skeleton we killed. It was here, right? Do we have the weapon? Yeah, we have the one with the dexterity. Here we will have some powerful monsters to deal with. This is also going to Akil's way. Yeah, there's quite a lot of stuff to be explored here. It's going to get a bit dark. Alright, oh, we already cleared here a bit. I remember last time we did it. But then we ran out of arrows and we had to to abort it. We have the Vino Moonshine Cave. Now we got the a... Grease to open the winch. 400 experience, very nice. And I can't believe that Vino from Lobat's farm would come into this forest to actually brew some potion, uh, not potion, some alcohol. A bit weird if you ask me, but... So arrows and gold, okay. I don't know if one of them is close or not. Didn't check it. Yeah, this one for example, see. So nice to not... Oh, a lot of gold, okay. So nice not to break any lockpicks. Quite good. The spirit of the wine. Can we read it? Does it do anything to us? I don't know if we can actually give it to Vino back or something. So can we do that? No, not enough resources. It's about ocean brood. Maybe one more. All right. After we do the cave near the Dexters, then we will have more. 
skeleton bones. Uh, we are run out of skeleton bones for sure. Oh boy. Physical protection, that's a new addition. Look how expensive that is. I like the effects. I believe we only drank four of them so far. Uh, grave mass, yeah, we have grave mass, but we don't have enough skeletons. Ah, oh, only two, okay. So we need eight more, and then we can actually make two new potions. That's a lot of protection passively, because we do need it. I like the way the game is made, like for real. It's changed quite nicely. Oh, a bolt. So now we will go through this and then come back on the other way. Because here are more stuff that we didn't kill. Oh, an arrow. I believe here we stopped. Swamp weed, lots of swamp weeds. And yeah, we also have to bring back the Eye of Inos that we got. It's broken and tell the, ma uh, the magicians that it actually broke. Somehow it did break. Oh, there is a snapper, okay. Wow, we really sniped it from this distance. There was another one, right? Ah, there are more of them, but way too far away. This one is a tree, yes. A young maple and an arrow. The sound it makes when cutting it is it's weird. This forest is really dense and scary, like no joke about it. Oh, we can deal some good damage. And sweet distance. We have an arrow in our hand. No. So we will check those monsters here. Then we will come back on the other way and explore all the forests. Kill Raider. There are some orcs, yeah. There is no buts about it. There it is, see? Luckily, oh, there is a work. Ooh. You mean, guys. Field Raider. There are more works here. And more orcs. Ah, there is one up there. See? You see it in the distance. Yeah, there he is. Their aggro range is insane. I don't mind you dying, just so you know. Nothing to be had there. Nothing here. We will explore this side, as we said, and then work. Okay, we we done with you. So much flora has been added to this mod. Also fauna, also on the on the new regions. Oh, there is a tree. Can we cut it? Nah, we cannot. I like that after we attack some of them, they actually charge. Nah, no nah, trees. We have to get those for ourselves. Yeah, let it come here. We have to kill also the bandits. So quiet and scary. Ah, we haven't been here. This must be also possessed. No? Okay. Yeah, they didn't possess all of them. I believe here is another King Sorrel that we have to get. How many do we have? We have one. Yeah, actually that's not bad. Then we can actually learn the strength. Potion, making of the potion. But I, I actually don't know if it's really needed or not. 
I believe it's on the other island. I mean the other hill. Like there. The king's sorrow, right? Must be. If not, we are going to, to find it anyway because we will have to... That's not what we wanted to do. So much damage we took. Oh. Some normal enemies, right, for us. We wanted to use the acrobatics, but... We don't have the acrobatics anymore. Yeah, I read about that, that it's, sometimes it's buggy. We have to relearn it by... I don't know, increasing our dexterity? No. Because now we have no more acrobatic. Even too, we have a lot of dexterity. So, here we have been. Oh well. Took so much damage for nothing. That's where we come from and that's where we have to go in. We know what's there, yeah. We have to know what there is. Oh, to shutting it now. It's very good. This one, you can sneak here and come and get a good sword. A very beginning sword. Beginner sword. Yeah, this one. It's actually just sword called. In the original, it's quite good. Yeah, this is 40 damage. Less strength, and in the normal it has also one-handed bonus, I believe, 5%. We have so many furs and stuff. We, we, we can get a lot more money. And look at those horns. Six of them already. Once we go into the big forest again, there is another shadow beast that I know of. I don't know if there are more, but not sure. And we want to go on this cave up here. If we get another king sword, then we can really get more strength. Potions. We can learn the making of the strength. No clue if it's on this hill or on the other. Might be that it is on the other, right? Where are we? Oh no, it's not on the other, it's here somewhere. Up here, maybe? Yeah, we are close by. Ah, there it is, see? King Sword, we got it. Thanks to the maps. Navigation. A ah, rusty sword. Don't you have more than that? Okay, a leather satchel. Very good. Also, there is a new cave that we can explore this one. And here it's going to be our, a hell of a fight. Most likely. Oh, poor guy. In the back here we get another dragon root. Somewhere, yeah, we got it, dragon root. And the guys, yeah, from the other... Ooh, don't fall down, please. On the other side we can kill it. We could do that in the fifth chapter anyway, but we will lose a lot of experience from the caves. You're in for it now. Are we? One is down. One more, okay. Not as strong as I expected them to be. But that is only because we are quite powerful now. You might be inside. Oh, he has a shield and probably a good shield. It. We got the Tower of Jack cleared out of the bandits. Okay, up there must be something. Oh, ah, oh, we already had this shield. 55 strength. Yeah, we are not going to really get 55 strength because as soon as we get more strength, we equip the dexterity stuff. Even one-handed, we we do uh, we deal quite great damage, even with what we have. Probably we, we are not going to waste our stuff on exp on strength, and then we can actually use the the dragon's root raw, eat them raw. But we shall see. Because in the last 
part of the game there we will have a lot of the skeletons and powerful ones there is another weapon here somewhere apparently no clue where but now we have Nicholas Didn't we kill those guys? Just die, you little beast. So we have Niklas to get out of the way. I believe there are some monsters up here, right? Oh, yeah. More scavengers. And blood flies. And whatnot. So nice when we actually have some power to actually make a difference. Yeah, we don't want to go on that edge. Not yet, at least. Here we get another crossbow, a very powerful crossbow for the beginning. Which is not really guarded. We can actually just run up here and just get it. Oh, Niklas. Niklas is useless, we can actually get him out of the way in the 5th chapter, we don't have to come here and kill him. Or maybe just save him after, under the 5th chapter and then we shall see if people actually prefer to kill everyone or just... Yeah, there is stuff down there. As I said, if people prefer to kill everyone before we go to Corinius or let them be enslaved by the works in the 3rd game. Oh, thank you. We still have learning points and we are going to level up, so yeah, let's do another one. Show me how. Ah, right. We are at the next level now, right? We already are because of the boo. It has a malus, that's why. We need 15 uh, 15 learning points. That means two more level ups and then we will get a master. If we would equip a a weaker bow? Any other bow than this, then we would get a 64% and we would be a master, I believe, or a marksman or whatever the name it is. We start from Niklas, we got some money, but the experience is the most important thing for us. We want experience. We want as much as possible experience to have. So now we are on the harder part of the forest to us. Ooh. A boar? Due to the increased range, we are going to pull some people from up there. What the hell? Did we snipe it from here? Yeah, we did. So, the next thing that can happen is this. See? They're not going to come down. They might be. As soon as we start collecting stuff here, they might just jump down. Oh well, they didn't then. We will get also a lot of experience once we go to the bandits camp and give the stuff to Fortuno. Yeah, the green novice guy, right? Right, Peter? Oh, we are so close to them, damn it. Okay, we survived this. There are more. We have to keep an eye out for them. There are more hidden monsters here into this cursed forest. Nice, we, we almost one shot them. Yeah, we still got, got a way to go now huge way to go until we can one shot them because we have no better bow than this and each level we increase our damage by plus five so all right the two orcs we killed already here but there are more in the back there Fortnite, okay 
and another hornet, two hornets. And the work, yeah. More works, yeah, look at them. Oh, how many works are there? Why we don't need anything? Yeah, okay, finally we hit something. Problem is there are way too many orcs, uh, works and we don't know which one we are going to pull. Oh, we killed one actually. That was perfect. The hornet and the works. We killed the work from such a huge distance. Ah, they killed the mole rats. There are more works. There must be more orcs here. Yep, two of them we heard. We hear them pulling their weapons. Okay, we can take two orcs. That means the value of mines. Nothing to plunder. Oh, we got those thing. So two orcs, and we lost the two. Two piggies. Two little pigs. So where are we here? Okay, we have to go on the left side again. Yeah, oh, another work. So here I have a trick that we could actually use. Okay. Then we can finally see stuff when we want to explore. I don't know if people want to do this or if they are okay doing it, but into this kind of flora then it's quite worth it as you can see you can actually see stuff now unlike before it looks ugly i i get it but otherwise we don't see anything there is rats also Whoa. Nice, at least our accuracy really increased, like it improved. Ah, we are back at the Vino, right? Yes, so up here we have something. Oh, Molderat, Hill Raider, oh, a lot more stuff. Okay, Hill Raiders. Oh, experience is good. Okay, that's what we have to be careful of. Then we have more works and some orcs, skeletons, and then we are done with this also. Then only behind Sekob. So when we are stronger, actually, it's quite good. We might be able to deal also with the Inubis cave near the Sekob. Oh, it deflected. Yeah, we are going to play with uh with this kind of the oh more mold rats okay of the plants and stuff to be removed like this. I don't know if we can see the the normal ones. Probably that also we can see. Ah oh, yeah, we we do see the other things. Otherwise, it's madness trying to collect stuff here. Oh, lots of plants here. No, not the real plants that we have to. This is a real plant. It cannot be picked because it's in the into the ground, into the graphics. Sometimes the mods do mess it up like this. So here is nothing as far as I remember. Oh, dragon root. See, are we at behind Sekob? Yeah, we are right behind. Uh, not Sekob, Akil. There are some skeletons also. Okay, there is something in the way that we don't actually see. Oh, 
There is something. Not anymore. Okay, we dealt with that. After those works, then we only have the right side of the force. Oh, that's that's going good for us. There are some skeletons up there that I remember. Yeah, more orcs, uh, works there. Let's deal with the skeletons and stuff. We have to get up here, so... Okay, what was that jerking stuff? There are the skeletons, see? Goblin skeletons, three skeletons. This is so scary. And the Oracle Elite. Oof, we have to go on the left side. Let's explore the left side first. A warrior only. We need our... Oh, we need a sword. And the magic not destroy undead. Kaiser. We could use another one. Why not? Oh, he fell down. Yeah, we can hit through your blocks. Okay, that's good. That went smoothly. Smooth, smoother than butter. Okay, we got its bone. Lance. There is only the goblin, right? It's only the goblin, yeah, then... We still have to go with a sword. Ah, oh, then we can do the bandits and stuff. Yeah, we can do a lot of stuffs. But we want to go this way and clear it. There are only some wards left. Yeah, with a critical hit we deal quite nice damage. But now just the works up here and below. Oh boy. So nice with all the so many plants at once. They are nice, but also very annoying if you ask me. And then there are more works. Oh, I thought we have a, again a acrobatics, but no. Yeah, moving is good for your health. We do know that. We are doing good. We are doing so great now. So many works. This is like the work land. No way we are going to snipe them from here. Oh, we did. We did hit them from here. Yeah, see? That's how they actually mess it up with a uh, jumping like this. Thanks to that, we managed to kill them. Ooh, what's that? Matrix? Was it a glitch into the Matrix? So we can collect those plants also on the way. On our way to clearing the forest. There are more orcs into the back there. And then we have the left side to deal with. And the uh, bandits. Then we can talk with Akil. No, we did talk with Akil about his people. They did return. I believe we are done with that, right? Except here. Here must be more works. Look at this. More plants. But there is another. Oh, this is new. It's really new. I've never knew about that. There must be another, another Inno statue. What the? Didn't know about that. Okay, never mind. There is the bugged one that we cannot get up there. Down here, there must be another you know, statue. 
Ah, this is this. This is it. Yeah. Statue of Enos. The rotting corpse. Well, I guess we cleared this side. We only have the other side with the bandits, some orcs, some skeletons. And then we are done with this. We will only have to go behind Sekop's farm. That's quite good. So then let's continue here where we left last time. We only have to be careful with the elite. There is a strong elite. Luckily, because of the removal of the plants, the huge plants, we can actually see stuff. Are those dead? Yeah, most likely they are dead. Oh my. Oh my. Oh, there is another dragon root, I believe. See? Oh, how pleasant. So, two hits, three, four hits. Three and a half. Those are going to be a big problem. Ah, I thought that would be the... Dragon root. Nah, why would that? Why would it be dragon root? Zombies, zombies, there, there, ah, there are the two skeletons. Ah, oh, goblin berry. Perfect. We can craft another plus three. We don't have another spell to pull them. Oh, I sir, we just need to pull them to us and then we need our master sword. Oh, I keep forgetting to, to sell those weapons. Okay, of course we cannot. We need more, more juice. We have no more juice. Ah, not the zombies, please. Skellies. Why don't we see the skellies? Now we see them. For real, did we get that guy also? Luckily, he is slow. We have to be careful with the grape mass also to not miss them. Does he deep? Yeah, he does some damage, right? Yeah, we need a bow. We are not going to deal with you without the bow. Too many hits. Sound is so scary when you are a, a little kid playing at night and you hear those stuff. That can be quite scary. I can tell you from my experience, that's the way it was. One more skelly and then... The cave with the bandits that take the ships away. Yeah, yeah. I know you don't like it. They doesn't see us or what? If we don't crit, then we are doomed. What the? What is he doing? Okay, that was some some shenny guns that happened there. Do you have any new stuff here? Plants, plants, plants. So let's check if there are more monsters on this side. There must be some more orcs. Some more orcs. Or no? Oh, there was a orc that we killed. No, nothing more. We just killed the bandits. We can do that in this episode. Yeah, let's do it real, real fast. It's night time anyway. We cannot take them there mid because they are way too dead, I believe. Yeah, that's the way, right? So, the weapon and then the bandits. And then we will get ourselves a ship. We have to rescue the sh ship. And in, I'll do it off screen as I said. Oh, we can actually wear the, the armor of the bandits and then just deal with those guys. What the? Let's, let's do the graphics back. 
believe that's okay. If we were their armor, but they don't have anything to say, you know. You should never have come here. Damn you. Who's the master? Bowman. Three of you. I have no clue if they would actually... Did you drop a weapon or one? Oh, heavy branch, okay. If they would give us experience if we would have talked with them. I believe not. Because they are just generic bandits. Ah, the bow. There was it. Hidden. And there we have... I believe her name is Betty, right? Or am I mistaken? Oh, we cleared it here. So, sheepy sheep, come with us. Come with me. Meh. Sheep in our squad. Bandit. Good bandit. Ah, she can sprint also. Very smart sheep. Who says that the ships are not so smart? Ah, she is fast. Can I believe we cleared that forest so easily? Yeah, look at this. We can barely see stuff now. Ah, okay. Do I have to take it back? Where is the ship? Stuck into the Laura. Behind Secops is going to take a, a bit longer because there are more stuff happening there. New stuffs got added. I found the oh, sheep. Oh, 400. Perfect. You were right. Those fellows in the forest cave did it. They'll never steal sheep from you again. Thanks. You sure are a strange mercenary. Not at all like the others I know. Take this as a small token of thanks for the selfless favor you did for me. Oh, thank you. Very good. Here's a few gold coins. I hope it's enough. Did anything else happen? No. I hope the sheep... Okay, well, we are going to make a cut here. We are going to sleep at, at the Orland, at his tavern. And next episode, we are going to go behind Secop's farm. There is a bit new of a portion of the map that got added there. And then we will go to the to fix the Eye of Enos and do the, the story with it. But for the time being, we can actually just go behind there and level up one more time. So thank you very much guys for joining me. I hope you had as much fun as I had in this episode. I hope you like killing. If you do, then we will kill some more in the next one. And I'll see you in the next episode. Be cool and bye bye.